Suppose that you are in an amusement park and suddenly you realize that your six-year-old child is missing. You inform the guards immediately and provide them with some photos and sub-biometric attributes of your child and you hope that they can find your child in a minute. As you guessed, my dissertation contributes to the human sub-biometric analysis in uncontrolled environments. An automatic approach is faster than manual inspection of the surveillance data, though many challenges are on the way, such as variation in body pose, illumination changes, occlusion, and low resolution data. To ease these challenges, we design a gender recognition model that can work in uncontrolled environments. In this model, we feed three different patches of the input photo to three pose-wise sub-modules to be able to focus on the face and body area and ignore the background. Our extensive experiments show that removing the background area can improve the recognition results. So, in the next step, we proposed a model that predicts several uh, sub-biometric attributes at once while it uses a masking layer to disregard the background features. In another part of this dissertation, we address the issue of background in the person with identification systems. To do so, we proposed a data augmentation technique in which the background regions in each pair of the instances are swapped. This way, the model rapidly learns that the identity and background regions are not correlated. Instead, face and body area are important. That seems impressive. Our model is not disregarded uh, by the background anymore. But what if people change their clothes? Should we think they are different individuals? Of course not. To address this issue, we developed a solution that ignores the closing cues and focuses on the identity relevant features. To do so, we proposed a model that minimizes the similarity between the original data and some synthesized data that highlight the closing features. This was an overview of our my dissertation topic. If you are interested in knowing more or collaborating with us, please do not hesitate to drop me an email. Thank you.